Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Last Ketchum. So today I am excited because I, I haven't seen y'all in forever. So I needed to definitely spend some time and get back in the things after all the chaos and the holidays. And I finally picked up a new pop. So I was super excited to show off what I did get. And then there was a couple things from the holidays that I got that I think are amazing. So I wanted to show those off too. I know at least one of those I had shown in like a live, but I'm like, but I didn't get to share it with y'all here. And y'all may have missed that. So I wanted to just, again, share these things with you because it's fun. <laughs> so I'm going to share the like things from the holidays first. And then I'm going to show you my pop. So if y'all are not interested in the other items I show, you can skip ahead or if you're curious, see what's up because one is a vinyl figure and then the other one is a very cool card. So stick around if you are interested. So the first thing is honestly something I wasn't sure if I was into at first, but then after a while and seeing them, I don't know why I feel like it kind of grew on me. I feel like I was the same way with kind of pops. Uh, just saw more and more until I was like, I need this in my life. And it's funny because uh, I got one. And again, I didn't buy this one. This was actually a Christmas gift and it was like perfect because honestly, I don't even know that I had even verbalized I wanted one of these. So it was just cool. Uh, but my beautiful assistant uh, got me this and it was a good gift. So just so you know what it is dumpster fire so of course it is a vinyl figure designer toy line i think these are like oddly adorable and like i mean like goes with the times right i also like the art i think it's really cute i mean obviously <clears throat> there's things that we will not discuss but just in general i think the little faces are just kind of ridiculously adorable uh <laughs> Are you serious right now? No, for real, is this really happening? Oh my God, even the little pizza has a face, trash has a face, like all the faces, sad face for falling over a trash can. But anyway, I don't know. I just think this line's kind of fun. I've seen people with all kinds of different ones. Um, they even make one with a mask now, you know, day and times makes sense. But anyway, here it is. Here's the actual figure. Look at that little face oh my gosh I don't know like I said I feel like these just grew on me and not even that there's like 100% soft anything like insanely magical about these like it's a pretty simple design it's just got a cute face I don't know I still just think they're kind of cool it's oddly not as like soft as I feel like I expect when they say it's soft I mean it has a little bit of give but I don't know why I just expect it's softer maybe like a squeaky toy soft I don't know just when they say soft I just expect something different but I mean it is smooth and nice and lovely so anyway that is my dumpster fire and I think it's uh, adorable so it's just something that I had to have uh, I don't know if I'm gonna end up like getting variations in this one or not because I know like they like I said I know they have them but I definitely wanted to have at least one and I have that in my collection now and I'm beyond excited for that so set that little guy down the other thing that I picked up, like I said, is a card, but why I think this is cool is one, y'all know I'm a Pokemon person, but this is one of the, I, I guess like a more unique one because this isn't like a card you're going to like just be like pulling. Like it's not like people in these trainer boxes and all that kind of stuff. You're not going to like, that's, that's not a part of these. Like this is a unique one. Uh, it's adorable. Um, this was a gift from my assistant as well. And it was like perfect. It's cute. It's unique. Uh, this was made in 2019, but they did some metal carts. So this is actually metal. And I'll pull it out of here because I know there's a little bit of glare, but like, uh, I know I don't have like gloves on guys, but like I said, this is actually a metal card. It's very cool. I don't know if... Uh, don't want to fall out of there, but angle it where maybe you can see some of those details a little better. But look at them. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Like I said, these metal cards were made in 2019. Absolutely cool and a half. 
can kind of hear their heaviness in there maybe, but anyway, it's just so cool, adorable, and just like a really unique piece, I think, to add into a collection, because like I said, it's not technically a card, even though it's a card, so I don't know. I just thought that was unique. It's cool. It's adorable. I'm like, I don't know how much fancier of a Pokemon card can you get than that? You know what I mean? Like, dang. I mean, they probably have some like crazy thing that I'm like not thinking of in this moment because I feel like I always forget something when I have a camera in my face. But this is just, I don't know. It's just too cool. So anybody that's kind of halfway interested in like kind of like unique collectibles of, I don't know, if it's Pokemon, if it's cards in general, if you just like having, I guess, like special pieces of like any type of line or collectible, I just think this would be a cool one maybe potentially to look into for your own collections. And look how cute they are. Anyway, let's move forward. And I normally am like, I will never wear gloves and I'm not even for this either. I just don't want to like smudge it because like I said, it's like, it's shiny and it's metal. It's not like... I don't know, touching paper or something, you know, like, I don't know. I don't want to clean it. Anyway, it's cool. So last thing is a pop, 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 pop. So the pop that I picked up is one that's been on my wish list for like ever. I was like, when did this pop even come out? Oh my gosh. I don't even know. Where is the number, the year? Man, I feel like I'm having like a total deep deep moment. Is it on here? Maybe not. I'll probably see it like as soon as I turn this video off. Anyway, but it's a Disney pop. It's one that, um, like I said, it's been on my wish list for like an eternity, but I haven't really seen it like in the wild. And like I said, a lot of my, I've, oh my gosh, my wish list. I don't know about y'all. I have an insanely long wish list, like insanely, insanely long. So I really am not like, oh, let me find every single one of these because one, I'd be broke and two, it would take forever. <laughs> but I just kind of keep an eye out. Um, and I finally saw one in the wild, um, I, you know, the store we normally go to here in Geek Vinyl. And I had to get it. You know, it's not something that's crazy expensive. It's just a cool one and I love it. So let me show you what it is. So it's dark from snow white oh my gosh okay now mind you i actually think all the dwarves are adorable i think the snow white pops are adorable uh the witch is a cool pop my wanting him i feel like the most like this was my most wanted of the dwarves is because of his glasses actually as silly as that is i think the way they did the glasses on him is so cute like there are other pops with glasses but they do them like different ways some like kind of sit funny i don't know but like i don't even know how to explain it i just think it's so beyond adorable like it just makes me happy like beyond i don't even know like i don't even have a good explanation for it i just think he is adorable and here's the other pops in that line i don't know how like awesome that wants to like zoom in right now or whatever but I don't know. I really kind of like all of them. I think Grumpy may be like a close second. Um, I don't remember. They may have actually had him too, but like I said, I always try to budget and try to be careful on like what I'm buying and how much, you know, just to be smart about collecting so I can continue to enjoy collecting and not, you know, be irresponsible in the process. So Doc was a big hit for me. And like I said, he's not an expensive pop. I think he's like 14 is his current value, at least on the Funko app. I didn't check PPG on this because really I'm not, it's not so much about the value for me. It's the nostalgia or a memory or something I think is cool or artsy or adorable. Um, and this also is nostalgia because I totally remember watching this movie, probably saw it a million times. So it's just a part of my childhood too. And y'all know like the retro toy line is one of my favorite lines because of the nostalgia. Anything that takes back to childhood and good memories of childhood, I definitely enjoy. And this is one of those. But like I said, I love him. I love the details of these cute little glasses. Oh my gosh. Like, and I'm just curious, you know, one, did y'all pick up anything cool recently or something that you've been wanting? You know, if so, share. What is it? What'd you get? You know, comment below, hit me up, IG, whatever. And is this a line, you know, as far as like, I don't know, a Disney movie that y'all enjoy? Did you like Snow White? 
Uh, are you into these pops at all? And like I said, this is the only, only pop I have out of this right now. Uh, I may end up getting more over time, but I don't think I've like, oh, bleh, bleh, bleh. I have not completed a single line of like anything. I think the only thing I have all of is like the DC black light right now, unless they make more. And then I'm like out of it, but there's only three easy to finish. But anyway, very excited to get this pop. Love it. Excited about everything I showed off to y'all today. I'm also just glad to talk to y'all again. I'm so glad to have another video out. I hope y'all enjoy it. I will try to be a little more on top of it, but uh, who knows? Y'all know I just kind of do it when it works and when it's not going to be, I don't know, stressful. I want to do it where it's always fun and I get to enjoy y'all. So I will be back. There will be more. And like I said, it's good to see y'all. <laughs> I hope y'all are having a happy new year and I will talk to y'all again soon. All right. Bye.